What's up guys, back in today with another reaction to Classroom of the Elite Season 2, this time of Episode 3. Uh, today's going to be a very exciting episode after we saw an Ayana Koji kind of spy on Kay last episode after she was getting bullied. Uh, a lot got revealed about her last episode, definitely made me like her a little bit more than um, I did beforehand, but I'm interested to see just what Ayana Koji is kind of planning at the minute. Uh, let me know what you guys thought about this episode though down in the comment section. Leave a like on the video if you guys did enjoy the video and subscribe to the channel if you do want to keep up to date with these reactions. And let's get into it guys. Two, one... Let's go. Yeah, it should be a very good episode by the uh, first two episode setups. We haven't had really too much in terms of the VIP at all, so I'm kind of wondering when that will become a, quick, a big part for Ayana Koji. I have a feeling it's not really that big of a thing for him because he maybe already figured it out. <laughs> not sure though. Yeah, I didn't think these guys were too bad. In episode two, uh, episode one, I should say, but last episode they were horrible little bitches, weren't they? Mad at that. Oh shit! Has this guy revealed himself. Again, it's stuff like this that makes her not that likable. But again, it's, it's just a harder out of shell, isn't it? Yeah, I think you've got an idea. Maybe that's why I didn't step in as well. Partly. What happened if they didn't? Would it just would have carried on? I guess nothing would have happened. I guess. <laughs> lucky he, lucky that guy did uh, kind of make a move. I think. Um, yeah, again, she's definitely got this real, it's like a turtle, isn't she? Definitely got this really hard out of shell. Even to show someone who stood up for her just then, she's still got in this defense mode, isn't she? <laughs> Some of these fucking opening uh, shots are very interesting, aren't they? Da, da, da. Man, I love this song. Uh, it's grown on me a hell of a lot since the first listen. Not like I didn't like it. I just didn't think it held a candle to the first opening. And the first opening still is an absolute banger. But um, this one is pretty close to it, I won't lie. Again, I don't think it's quite as good, in my opinion. But uh, still a banger. Or pawns. Eho. Which one is Shiho? I don't quite remember. Again, a lot of names to deal with in this show. Oh, look where you are. This being I oh shit. Really? I I was thinking maybe that that was an eye and a koji getting he he writes help. How the hell did these girls get he ratted the text? And that's the girl that she bumped into, I guess. How the hell did these guys get he ratted to get her to go down here?
And you're right. Oh my god, this breathing, man. And still you attack her after knowing this. Doesn't look like the girl in the back wants to do anything to do with this, does it? It was very odd that they're recording this. Oh my god. Oh well, thank god. Why? Why did you keep going? Doesn't look like she wants anything to do with this, but she's still just... Oh my god. I have a feeling he might be here. Again, I thought it was him meeting her, but fucking hell, that's disgusting. Oh, is that... Oh, I guess it was him texting the girl with the glasses. Okay. So, he, is he trying to break Kay down? Is that what he's trying to do here? Trying to get her to her lowest point? Jesus Christ, how could you fucking watch that, though? That's the thing. I mean, fair enough if you want to actually get something out of it, like help her, but um, to watch it all as well. Yeah, maybe this is his way of getting a message that sticks with her. Knows everything. I mean, if he wanted to, he probably could, but I don't think he's really interested in those type of things. Oh my god, maybe I was wrong. <laughs> no, I don't, I, don't, I don't think he's actually going to do this. No fucking shot are they going to make the main character of any show a rapist. Well, say that, Michelle Coutente say is almost on that level. I wouldn't quite say rapist. But, um... Still something hidden. Huh. Massive scar on her ribs. Fucking has been through a lot, hasn't she? Jesus Christ. Imagine being so ready to be raped like that. Bit ominous. 
ominous there, eh, Adokoji? Then again, when is he not? Huh. Yeah, I think so too. So he, he got a video as well, nice. It was pretty fucking stupid of the girls to record themselves doing that, to be honest with you. I imagine the school could probably very easily get their hands on that video. Let's go, man. Let's go. Yeah, she's got a lot of influence, even if it is as this act. Well, yeah. One of the worst things she's worst at. That's pretty awesome then. We've got the brains and the and the planning and such of Horikita. We've got the influence of K. We're building up a little harem here. <laughs> she the VIP. Ah, I wonder what you said there. If you know Japanese, you might be able to read that. But perhaps she might be the VIP. Ah. And now he's bought something off of his homeroom teacher. Gonna have a little peek at a phone, I guess. <laughs> Can you unlock these without like a code or anything? I'm not 100% sure. Well, maybe not. Lucky we didn't, to be fair. That's interesting, isn't it? It actually sleeps here before the fucking meeting To a certain extent, you could maybe pay to move to A class, uh, to B class, and then move to A class. You'd have to pay twice, but possible, right? Yeah. And she's got a fucking ton of them. Yeah. How many was it the change? Was it 20 million? I can't quite remember. This reputable. <laughs> Again, I find it very interesting. It goes with her, doesn't it? That she's actually sleeping here <laughs> before the fucking meeting. I wonder what she's hiding there. If anything. Yeah, how does this guy plan on stopping that? I guess we maybe take everyone's phones at the same time. 
that's true as well. This is uh, this is pretty interesting. This is pretty interesting technique, actually. Yeah, these guys have always been kind of out of the conversation, haven't they? But now he's trying to defend himself. So maybe this, uh, maybe this. Yeah, it looks like it's her that set this up. Yeah, maybe he might be hiding something there. As he got defensive. Right, he's done it now. Ah. Justin. Who is it? Is it him? Still, I still have K in mind. Oh shit! It's this guy. Whose name I don't know. <laughs> so what the hell did K? What the hell did Diana Koje say to K then? That we didn't hear. Yeah, obviously. Oh, he's not. Oh, shit. So, why other coach was the VIP? Maybe that's what he told Kay. Interesting. So, they just switched phones. Is this. Did someone already betray them? Oh, no. sake really well, why do you have to come out with this so quickly it's your nose eh? why have you done this she could have just held her tongue there right Fuck off, you bitch. I've heard enough of those girls. What the hell? Did he plan for this then? Look, uh, did you know, Zay? Why would she do that? I mean, obviously, she wants to do well. Oh, so was Kay actually the fucking... Did they switch phones as well? Oh my god. <laughs> so she was the VIP. That's what he said. Okay, so I got it right. But then I just got sent for a fucking loop. <laughs> like the rest of everyone else. So he did kind of plan Itch and Ose to call. Kind of. That kind of dealt with any kind of interventions, I guess. Wow, so we done a little phone swapping. Pretty, uh, pretty trustworthy thing to do from him, isn't it? And all three of them, to be honest, switching their phones like this. Oh, apologies, guys. Yeah. Yeah, he did think of this. Just say that was that was easily rumbled, like within seconds.
So he, that's what he bought. Okay. Interesting. So she knew about it as well. Okay. I might be underestimating her, you know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, she did. Okay, so what's happened now then? I think we're going to have to pause there. A class minus 200. Fucking hell. That's a lot of minuses for A class. Jesus Christ. B, no change, which is fine. Um, yeah, it looks like class C won. Class C done pretty well, though. Second place. 50, uh, 50 points. Pretty good. But, um, yeah, it looks like class C had a wrap on things. I think we kind of knew they had a wrap on things, didn't we? They were getting so much information out of every one of their classmates three two one yeah class A got fucked there's the uh, one black dude And she was. Well, we knew that from end of season one. I'd love to see a fight between that big black guy and Ayana Koji, you know, <laughs> to see what happens. Yeah, we are now getting targeted by Classy, which is not good, isn't it? Considering the amount of control that guy has. Koenji, I think his name is. Um, yeah, that would be a fight I'd love to see. <laughs> I'm hoping we do see one day, maybe, the one black American guy versus Ayana Koji. He's been seen as pretty much almost invincible. Yeah, that was a really good episode today, wasn't it? Some uh, interesting happenings with the VIP, which has been a little lackluster in the last two episodes, I won't lie. There hasn't been too much kind of focus on that. Of course, the first episode was pretty much focused at explaining it. But um, actually on the goings-on in the game, this episode was uh, very interesting. That looks like it's going to be over next episode. But um, yeah, interesting... Uh, Plan from Ayana Koji as well, kind of breaking K down right to her worst, right to that core of the uh, the issue, I guess, and then getting through to her that way. Teaming up with her as well. Can't wait to see that again. She's uh she's really come around for me, K. Once you understand something, it's uh well. It is what it is, isn't it? You understand and you can appreciate her stand on things, her point of view and her actions now. Whereas before they were an absolute mystery and they were just they just seemed like terrible actions. Um yeah, it was uh, some tough scenes to watch today, wasn't there? Some very tough scenes to watch again. I'm um it's crazy how Ayana Koji could just in both the end of episode two and this uh, and the start of this episode just kind of watch this all kind of unfold and um 
uh, not really show pleasure, but not show any kind of displeased. Uh, um, well, I think he did show a little bit of displeased just by saying that he's going to protect her from now on. I think that was maybe his um, his kind of unconscious way of kind of showing some uh, kind of respect or, um, or or kind of helping her in a way. But um, yeah, just crazy how you can just kind of watch that go down again with some very tough scenes to watch. But um, again, awesome episode in general for me. Um, again, we got awesome half of the VIP stuff and awesome half of getting through to Kay and um, seeing about the relationship with uh, Ayana Koji and uh, building that relationship as well and that helping us out with this uh, with, with this game. Um, again, it was very, uh, very good in my opinion. Um, I did see some comments beforehand saying this episode sucked. And again, in my opinion, it was probably the best yet. So um, can't wait to see what happens next week. Let me know what you guys think about this one down in the comment section though. Leave a like on the video if you guys did enjoy the video and subscribe to the channel if you want to keep up to date with these weekly reactions i'll be back next week with episode four so if you can join me for that and have a good rest of your day guys